Namaya, member of LACNIC Sport. Welcome. To start, I will give the floor to Jorge Villa. It's almost good afternoon, no longer this morning. I was asked to address a few words. I was asked by Ariel, the, our chair at LACNOC. So very rapidly, let me share a couple of things with you. This has been a truly excellent Greek, very intense here in Fortaleza. First of all, I'd like to thank the city of Fortaleza for welcoming us and for bearing with us throughout this week. I think we have behaved quite well, but even so, we'd like to thank the city because that is important. I'd also like to thank all the speakers we had this week. I think this has been an excellent program, and I hope you enjoyed it too. Almost all speakers managed to travel to Fortaleza and were here with us. I'd also like to thank Rick Compton, who couldn't travel because he had other commitments, but he made his presentation online. He was one of the keynote speakers. I'd also like to thank the other two keynote speakers, Peter Wood and Doug Madury, who's still here with us. So this was a very intense week and a most interesting week, too. We had several sessions of interest, particularly for this organization. I'd like to highlight the first members' assembly of LACNOG, where we restructured several of the functions in LACNOG structure. Although we are a group of engineers who continue, wish to continue having fun while we operate the networks, despite all the problems that this might bring about. But the truth is that we really needed to be better organized. So this is what we did during that assembly. So from now onwards, Hopefully, this organization will be better structured and we will be able to work very well based on the challenges we have ahead. So once again, I would like to thank you for your patience, for having been here all week. I'd like to thank all the people who have made our life easier, the interpreters who help us tremendously with communication, and so that you can understand the contents that is shared in this event. I'd like to thank all the speakers and above all, LACNIC, who with their staff, of course, it's always a pleasure to work with them and all for, also for your support for being here on a Friday at this time of the day. Many of you have been thinking about going out to the beach or somewhere else. So thank you very much for staying on with us until right to the end of this event. So thank you very much and see you next time. Thank you, Jorge. Thank you, Jorge. We now give the floor to Milton from nick.br. Good afternoon. On behalf of Nick.br, we would very much like to thank LACNIC for having chosen Brazil once again 
to host this very important event. This event favors the relationship to this community and works for the benefit of the internet to have a better internet. So we are very pleased for this Fortaleza. I hope you liked this city really made a lot of effort to have a successful event. On behalf of Nick BR or regarding Nick BR, I'd especially like to thank the team of the events, Aliana Roy Spell. Could you please stand up? A big round of applause for them, please. They really counted on support from the administrative part and from the legal area of NICBR. There were many challenges that we had to overcome to make this event a successful event with us. Is also the network team. So if there are no claims, then this means that they worked very well. So I would like Cardini, Daniel, and Pedro to please stand up so that you can also receive your applause from the participants. And that was all. And hopefully you enjoyed this event. I hope this was a fruitful meeting for all of you. And we look forward to meeting you very soon. Thank you. Thank you very much, Milton. Now we're going to give a gift to Milton and Wardner. Please, could you please come up? Thank you. And now I will give the floor to Wharton Meyer after the picture. First of all, I would like to apologize to my Spanish-speaking friends, but because we are in Brazil, I will address the closing words in Portuguese, and I'll try to speak slowly so that you can understand me. First of all, I would like to greet my friends from the plenary session, Jorge and Milton. I'd like to greet all of you who were with us during this event. It is always very positive. This week, we had a week that was full of panels, of knowledge, of tutorials, technical presentations, networking meetings. I'd also like to greet the remote participants. There was a big number of remote participants. These are the official numbers that our communications managers have shared with us. 665 participants were here and 300 participants followed us remotely. But then there were many more participants through YouTube, but they didn't conduct the full registration process. These are the official numbers, but we are aware that there were many more participants. Over the past days, we were able to 
note that there was a lot of networking. There were six tutorials speaking about RPKI, IRR, network operations, BGP, IPv6 only networks, LACNOC had 19 presentations, all of which were of great interest and with a lot of questions too. We also had quite different and interesting panels too. For example, a panel on submarine cables, which is a reality for Fortaleza specifically. This is quite a strong reality here. It's a very important here. So it is important to share knowledge such as that. We also had a panel on fair share. And one of these interesting new options that we have, in fact, this is not so new. This is a discussion, a debate that has been in place for quite a long time now. So providers from the media to and providers and content providers. So this is quite an interesting panel too. There are also legal issues, site blockings, leasing of IP addresses. And we also had the public policy forum, which is also very always very important. We had four proposals with quite a numerous participation. The Internet Measurement Working Group made four presentations. So here, parallel to this, we had other events. For example, the first meeting, the DNS space. We had the first LACNOG assembly, as well as the LACIX technical working group meeting. These were events that took place parallel to this event. And I would also like to thank all the people who made this event possible. I'd like to thank the instructors of the tutorials, I'd like to thank the moderators, the participants who were essential, because these always strengthen us as a community. We'd also like to thank, especially like to thank those who the personnel who was most involved in the organization of the event, the members of the community to, who somehow contributed to the success of this event. We'd like to thank the, thank the 21 sponsors of the event and LACNIC's team, LACNIC's staff, who every year show their hard work. We have been following LACNIC's event for many years now. And we see that the staff surprises us again and again with a high standard of professionalism. To finish, let us now speak about the future. Let us speak about the next meeting, which we already defined. This will be from May 6th to 10th in Panama. So we would like to have the presence of all of you. Many Brazilians will uh, are here. And finally, let me thank your presence and the f and we want to thank you for uh, having helped us uh, to build this uh, event that we are closing now. Thank you. Thank you, Wagner. Thank you for the participation in LACNIC uh, uh, 40, LACNOC 2023. I hope that we have uh, made the most of it and we'll meet again in LACNIC 41 in Panama.